go. Risky boots. You are finished. Perfect. Ammo Baron. The fantastic world of Risen 3, Titan Lords. Risen 3 is the biggest Piranha Bytes game to date, featuring a thrilling tale of demonic dangers and daring battles set against the majestic backdrop of a beautiful, handcrafted medieval world just begging to be explored. This time around, you'll get the chance to choose from one of three different factions to pledge allegiance to, which has consequences for the quest line, as well as the skills you can unlock, the armor you can wear, what type of weapons you can use, and more. Risen 3 offers you hundreds of quests to tackle, making the game twice as big as its predecessor. And while selecting a faction is perhaps the biggest choice in Risen 3, many others await. Choose how to best tackle quests. Choose from one of a number of companions to join you in your quest, each with their own story, agenda, personalities and abilities, or even choose which profession to specialize and progress in, be it hunting, prospecting, blacksmithing, or many others. And regardless of which faction is joined, players can also choose to specialize in which style of combat they prefer. Ranged, melee, or a mix of the two. Or decide to focus on spells to deal damage to single enemies, the whole area, or by indirectly affecting the battle. So with three different factions, three different styles, and three very different perspectives on the world and the events, only one question remains. Are you going to take?
My name's Guybrush Threepwood, and I want to be a pirate. What did you say your name was again? Guybrush Nosehead. Froomweed. Thriftweed. Spice cake. Call me Squinky. <laughs> you just don't know when to quit, do you? Okay, maggot, whip that sword out and let's see what you can do with it. I'm gonna put you up against... The machine. Yikes. Back in the day, we'd play the game until we got stuck, and obviously there was no internet uh, to help us along. Gee, I don't know how much longer I can hold my breath. We didn't want people to have to break the experience, so we created a hint system integrated directly into the game. Well, that wasn't so hard.